when it hit, I guess I can say COVID was really devastating for the community. The pantry lines were around a complete block. I've never seen anything in all my life like that. Many of the neighborhoods where our gardens are located are some of our most underserved areas in the city for the most part. They were the hardest hit by COVID. So, you know, having our garden spaces out there, having a safe place for people to go, whether it's gardening, whether it's just a place to sit and relax and reflect, we wanted to make sure that people had access to those spaces during, during those really, really rough times. New York Restoration Project believes wholeheartedly that nature is a fundamental right. We were founded over 25 years ago by Bette Midler. We steward two major parks in Inwood on behalf of the Parks Department. Throughout the city, we have 52 community gardens that we work hand in hand with volunteer gardener networks to make sure that those gardens are programmed, maintained, and built in the vision of that community. The direct support that we received from NYRP was just phenomenal. We're just grateful because it was a time that we, we suffered. People had lost their jobs and could not feed their families. We had to turn our public programming into how do we grow food to give to the community. A lot of the garden groups really took the initiative to use their space as something to give back to the community. And so many of them across the whole city were doing giveaways throughout COVID. NYRP and our gardens and our parks were really essential. They weren't just a garden, it wasn't just a park. It became a de facto senior center, a camp, someone's backyard, someone's vegetable stand. It became all of these things at a time when our city was hurt the most. And that's why our work is so important. Because you support NYRP, we can support 52 community gardens and help them feed their neighborhoods. It's just beyond what we do here at NYRP. It reverberates. It really is changing lives. Your donations and your support is changing lives. Simple things like getting outside, sitting under a tree, growing a vegetable is really meaningful. That's nature. That's nature in an urban environment. And so we believe, yes, nature is a fundamental right. We're in this together, and I couldn't be more proud of our work. Thank you.